Scusi. You're not supposed to be back here. Well, neither are you. But I'll tell you what, I won't tell anyone if you don't. You have something I want, and you're going to give it to me. Really? Well, I'm flattered, but I'm afraid I'm spoken for. If you'll excuse me. I'm not in the mood for games. Give me the crucifix. Lady, you're lucky I'm a gentleman. Because if I were... I would... You'd what? All right, fine. Just remember, I didn't want to do this. Let's see what you've got. Come on. Don't telegraph. Nice try. I gave you that one. That's not nice. Just... Come here. Now hand me the artifact. Alright, look. I have this nice astrolabe back home. Slightly used. I'll give it to you for a fair price. I have a better idea. Alright, look. I'm still a little jet lagged. How about we just call it even? Paid enough? Or do you want to keep being a smart ass? You know, you're breaking a lot of expensive stuff in here. If you're not careful, they're gonna kick us out of here. <laughs> All right, wait, wait. It's in my back pocket. Where is it? Right there. <laughs> 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 Just met your friend Nadine Ross. She's lovely. Yeah, well, it's total chaos out here. They're trying to keep it contained, but everybody's freaking out. I don't want to rush you, but hurry the hell up. <laughs> Nathan, where you at? Good question. You? By the ballroom. Look for this round sign thing. It's on the way. Round sign thing. Check. Good news is I got a gun. See you soon. <laughs> Just met your friend Nadine Ross. She's lovely. Yeah, well, it's total chaos out here. They're trying to keep it contained, but everybody's freaking out. I don't want to rush you, but hurry the hell up. Nathan, where you at? Good question. You? By the ballroom. Look for this round sign thing. It's on the way. Round sign thing. Check. Good news is I got a gun. See you soon. Just met your friend Nadine Ross. She's lovely. Yeah, well, it's total chaos out here. They're trying to keep it contained, but everybody's freaking out. 
I don't want to rush you, but hurry the hell up. Nathan, where you at? Good question. You? By the ballroom. Look for this brown sign thing. It's on the way. Brown sign thing. Check. Good news is I got a gun. See you soon. Te lo juro. Ho visto qualcuno che usciva dalla finestra della biblioteca. L'ho sentito, ma non sono riuscito a vederlo. Sono strati i testi. Qui! Vetri rossi! Ho trovato dei vetri rossi! Da questa parte! in there <laughs> I can't get to you from here you got a way down yeah yeah I think so okay I'll meet you in the driveway just head towards the ballroom all right see you there Victor, I'm kind of stuck here any ideas yeah. the fastest way is through the ballroom, oh, the ballroom shit. Is locked down. yeah well now that they know it's you guys they cleared the place out that right, ballroom it is you get that Nathan yeah, got it.
Almost to the ballroom. Nathan, I'm pinned down in here. I could use a hand. On my way, Sam. Oh, good.
Unless you're driving a hearse, you better hurry. for this. Shit. What? It's empty. What? Oh, you're such an <laughs> asshole. He's your brother. All right. Skull and crossbones. Very good, sir. Xavier's insignia. What is this? Uh, Hodie mecum eris in paradise. Today you will join me in paradise. paradise. It's what Jesus said to St. Dismas on the cross, right? But what about these numbers here? What do, you, what do you make of this? Some kind of code or a phone number. <laughs> Come on. The dates. Huh? Look. 1659. It's the year Avery was born. 1699. Let me guess. The year he died. Well, uh, by most accounts, yeah, but it means we have date of birth, date of death, and Paradise, which means we're looking for Avery's grave. It's St. Dismas's Cathedral. <laughs> Wait a second. Hasn't Rafe been scouring that site for ages already? Yeah, the cathedral. See these symbols? Yeah. These are found on old Scottish gravestones. Right. Right? Now, look at this. The layout of this place is really unusual. Uh. Here's the cathedral, but the graveyard it's way over here. Rafe's been focusing on the wrong area. Exactly. Guys, we're going to Scotland. All right, all right. Wait, wait up. You do realize that Rafe knows you're coming. Yeah, we can deal with that when we get there. Look, that psycho would like nothing better than for you to show up. Plus, he's got Nadine and her whole army to back him up. Yeah, but he doesn't have this. The biggest pirate treasure of all time is within our grasp. I thought this was about saving Sam. It is. Well, come on, it's both, right? We need the treasure so we can save Sam. How is Elena cool with all this? Oh, Jesus, kid. Look, it's just not that simple. But with all that you two have been through together... She wouldn't understand this. You are not giving her enough credit. I can't take that chance. <clears throat> Nathan, he's right. Things have changed. Rafe's involved now, and I can I can take this on my own, really. Great. Well, thank you for your input, both of you. Excuse me. Hey. Hey, it's me. Yeah. Now the reception's lousy. Yeah. Something on your mind, dear? Look, I, um, I realize it couldn't have been easy. All those years away. And I'm sorry for what happened to you. But it's not his fault. I never said that it was. It took a long time for him to get out of this game. You see a gun to his head? He chose this. Okay, he's meant for this life. You really believe that? Why are you here, Victor? Because somebody's got to keep an eye out for him. No, I'll just see you in a few more weeks. Yeah, I will. Okay, I love you too. Bye. Just told her that the job was gonna take a little longer than expected, which is the truth, right? So come on, what do you say? Sam could still use our help. 
Well, <clears throat> I do hear that the weather is particularly fine in Scotland this time of year. 